Hello, everyone, and welcome back, my friends, to another episode of, of uh, Therapy Shopping, of course. Today, we are not going to be doing a mystery box. We are actually going to be doing jewelry sorting. So, I have a whole bunch of necklaces that need to be sorted, and we can go ahead and look at these pieces, and then I'm going to put them in a pile of where they need to be sorted to. So, here's this gorgeous one. Look at this beautiful piece. The colors on it are so pretty. So this is going into the multi-category. And we have this one. This one's another beautiful. You have kind of your smoky, smoky coloring. This will definitely be going into the silver category. And here's a gorgeous... Here's a fun one. This is a brass. You have all these just different color links on there. So that will go into our brass category. And we have about, I don't even know how many we have. So this one is pretty. It's a gray with a little bit of that sparkle on there, that shimmer. So that will go into our gray. Is that white or gray? Is that white or gray, you guys? I can't tell. Maybe that will go into our white category. So white. And we have this one, a beautiful pink. That will go into our pink category, we'll put pink right there. Oh, I love this one, this one's so pretty. This is your gold, look at how gorgeous. Gold will go next to pink. And copper, so this will go into our copper, all these little copper discs that hang down more of a rustic. So we have, um, <laughs> I have I think like, maybe a thousand necklaces that need to be sorted so I'll be posting a number of these these will go into the orange orange category and here is a this one might let's see if I can get it out hold on this one needs to get there we go okay put this one back so it doesn't get tangled and then we'll look at this one. This one's really pretty. This is a three layer. So you have your three layers with your little feather that hangs down. So cute. This is an orange. We'll go in the orange category. And a gorgeous bright copper. This is a choker. So it's going to sit higher on your neckline. Cute little earrings. Copper category. This would be, it's not white, is it? It's not quite white and it's not, would that go in white? White probably. Yeah, because these are white. Ooh, look at those cute little free earrings. Okay, so that will go into our white category. And this is our silver. Look at that cute 3D, little 3D heart on that one. And this is a long necklace. So our white, white category because this has bling on it when it has bling. Then it goes into the white if it's solid, then it goes into silver. And this one's gorgeous. This is a vintage, this one. You have your orange crackle stone with that feathering on there. So it goes into the orange category. This one's also very vintage. You have your deep plum color with your knotted seed bead. That will go into purple and purple will go right up here by the pink. Here's a blue category. It has your brushed metallic bead on there. Blue. Oh, this one's cute. This is your black metal. Just your little fish chain. Or what's the name of this chain? A snake chain, I guess. So you have, no, a snake chain I think is more rounded. But look at that gorgeous choker. Oh my goodness. And that is under the black category. Speaking of black, here's another black one. You have your beautiful drop down, kind of a fringe of silver and black, and that will go in the black category. This is a purple. I love the connections here. So that goes under purple. Look at the cute little earrings on this one. So cute. Your silver category. another purple one. You have your little translucent glass bead and this is a long necklace. 
so pretty, isn't it? How are you guys? How have you been? I hope you're having a good day today. I am. The sun is out. This is a cute choker with your little turquoise. Cute little free earrings. I love this one. This is one of my favorites. Blue category. Ooh, here's a gorgeous brown. Look at how gorgeous that sand color pearl. Isn't that so, so pretty? I love this one. So this will go in our brown category. These pieces are so pretty. Here's a yellow. So you have just your dainty little yellow flower on there. Oh, this one's so pretty. So this is your deep plum tone. And look at this gorgeous waterfall cascade. That's so pretty. Love that one. That goes in purple. And here's a yellow. Your little yellow crackle stone with your fringe and the yellow. And that one goes in our, oh, yellow's over here. Here we have a silver, cute little earrings. Kind of a twisted interwoven chain on that one. So it goes into silver. And this one is a combination of your purple and gray tones. Because the gray is a more neutral, I think I'll go ahead and place this in the purple category. Here's another beautiful purple. You have your moonstone on there and your moonstone pendant. This is a long necklace. So that goes in the purple category. And here's another purple. This is so cute. I have an earring that matches this. That would make such a nice set. And actually I have a bracelet with that same stone in there as well. That would be a cute three piece set. Here's a blue. This is a little bit of your darker blue teal tone. Look at the cute little earrings. And then you do have your drop down fringe. So that is a blue. A copper, you have your cute copper earrings and then your layers of the copper, your luscious layers of that. I love the shimmer of light on that one. So copper category. Here's a man's chain in your brass. You can also double this up and I think would sit as a choker if you wanted to, or you can wear it as a long. That's a brass. Oh, here's a vintage. This one's super vintage. Vintage paparazzi piece with your crackle stone. And this is a red. And we don't have any red started yet, so I'll start a new pile right over there. Here's another yellow. This one's so gorgeous. You have your little yellow earrings. And look at how pretty this one is. Oh, you have your yellow and orange flowers. So cute. Since the earrings are yellow, I'm going to go ahead and place this in the yellow category. Even though technically I guess it could be a multi. Here's a brown. You have your silver earrings and your gorgeous brown pearls with your kind of woven bead. I love that bead. I think it's so interesting. And my brown. There it is. Look at this one. It's super fun. You have your golden hoop. You have got black leather cording and then these layers of circles interwoven. So that will go in our gold category, which is right there. This is so nice to get these sorted. Here's another cute little charm earring. This is a double layer. So you have a shorter choker and you just have a simple little, little, um, pendant on there. So cute. Those are layering. So cute. Such a cute little summer necklace. And that goes over there. Here's a black Ooh, this is a statement necklace. It's very long. You have your black crackle stone with your black and gold combination. We don't see that very often. Not in the black crackle stone. Here's another gold. Let's look at this one. You have your fringe earring. And look, oh, it says the word mother with a little heart. I love the bar, the bar um, style of necklaces. I think that's so cute to layer those up. Here's a long gold one. So you have your little fringe and your woven. So this is actually a two tone. You have your silver and your gold woven. I will put that in the gold category. Here's a blue. This one's a vintage too. Look at this turquoise. 
Isn't that gorgeous? I love the flat pebbles on that one. And that goes into the blue category. Here's a blue chain. You have your layers of chain on there. And look at this, the bright, almost like a neon blue. Cute. I have the perfect hoops that would go with that one. And here we have another. This is your gray. You have your little gray earrings and then your gray pendant. The light does pass through that, so it's a little bit translucent. And I'm gonna go ahead and end it there. I'm going to try to make these about 10 minutes each. So we did go through quite a few. I could probably move a little faster on my next one. But join me for part two. Oh my gosh, we probably have like a hundred parts because we only went through like 20 and I think I have over a thousand. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.